Yeah, it's the spelling bee. Yeah. Today is Friday, day after Thanksgiving. This is episode 10 of Yo, It's a Spelling Bee. Season one, episode 10. Looks like I'll be hosted by myself today. Looks like I'll be hosted by myself today, but we got two of the dopest and the dope in here today. We got Scrappy on the top right hand corner, contestant number one. And we got Pla, lower right hand corner, contestant number two. Here goes a quick rundown of the rules, contestants. I am going to say a word. I'm going to follow up with a sentence and a definition okay once i complete the sentence and the definition go ahead and give yourself time to spell the word all right we're going to do 12 words a piece each round any other contestants that just walked in go ahead and request the box as we working on round two i'm gonna need y'all to make sure the camera stays on you so we can have a uh, no cheating right i'm silka this is my live welcome to yo it's a spelling bee episode 10 season one and here we go all right we're gonna do rock paper scissors shoot obviously i hope y'all know how to play the game the game was created in like 1982 so y'all should know what the game is let's get it rock paper scissors shoot both my contestants <laughs> Ready? One, two, three. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh, shit. One more time. <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. All right, looks like scrap starts. Ah oh, man. I should have lost. Uh-oh. All right, scrap. You ready? Yeah, let me get my word, man. Okay, the first word is Philadelphia. A city founded in 1862, located in the state of Pennsylvania. Philadelphia crime rate is through the roof, but free AR, free AR, where's it? Where, how you say your name? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. AR yeah, yeah, yeah. and skinny me. No, get them out of here. Anybody in the comments spelling these words will be disqualified. Scrap, where you go? Why you at the camera? All right, all right. My I ain't word is gonna lie. Philadelphia. Yeah, I, I, need you, I need you to stay in your seat. We're gonna think you cheating, all right? All right, let's P go. P H I L I D E L P H I A. One more time. Oh man, I forgot. <laughs> that is incorrect. Oh. All right, oh well. same word for you, Plot. Oh man. <laughs> P H I L A D E L P H E A. I don't know. He lost too. He got it wrong too. That is incorrect. Do I get another chance? Challenge. Challenge. Okay. Um. Do you think you're gonna get it right? I think so. Challenge. I definitely don't know how to spell Philadelphia. Right. One second, one second. Challenge. I'm laughing. Go ahead, try it again. P H I L Y D E L P H I A. There's no Y in Philadelphia. Damn, so niggas need to stop calling that shit Philly then. Okay, the, all right, I'm gonna need you to not curse. This is, um, we're being recorded, so we can't curse. All right, Philadelphia is P H I L A D E L P H I A. Philadelphia. Oh, oh it's an A, not an I. Okay. One second. Um, I knew it was something. Let me wrong. do it one more time. Spell it one more time. She said it's P-H-I-L-A-D-E-L-P-H-I-A. -E yep, that's okay. correct. All right, do me a favor. Anybody that's in here, please record the show for me. Anybody from City Hall, record the show for me. It doesn't look like Twag is here. I need y'all to record the show. Can I rely on anybody to record the show while I'm live? Because I cannot do both.
Tata, you there? Hana, which one of y'all? Well, Hana, thank you, Tata. All right, we're going to start one more time. We're going to start fresh on a recorded. Let me know when you're ready. I'm ready. Like, I'm ready. Dog. It's hot with this thing on my head. Okay, then you can tie it around your eyes. Now, nah, come on. We go. I open the window. We go. All right. So, our next word. Okay, you both spelled it wrong. So, we're going to go with Plav being the next contestant. The next word is opt, opted, making a choice from a range of possibilities. The sentence for opted is hundreds said to have opted to leave Twitter over Elon Musk's ultimatum. Opted. Opted, O P T E D. Opted. That's correct. Good job. Okay, the next word is going to be for Scrappy. Subsequent, coming after something in time. The sentence for subsequent is, even though the man was not considered a suspect at first, his subsequent actions at his wife's funeral put him on the detective's list of suspects. Subsequent. S-U-B-S-A-Q-U-E-N-T. That is incorrect. Clive, same word. You need the sentence and definition again. Subsequent. Oh, uh, C, I mean, S U B S E Q U I. I don't know. So it's going. That is incorrect. <laughs> the correct spelling for subsequent is S U B. Mm. S E Q U E N T. Subsequent. I forgot the end. That's what I forgot. <laughs> okay, we're going to go with scrap. You ready, scrap? Yeah. The next word is jeopardy. The definition for jeopardy danger of loss, harm, or failure. The sentence for jeopardy is Kenneth chose. Kenneth chose the wrong route on Wednesday that put his life in jeopardy. Je jeopardy is the word. J-E-A-P-O-R-D-Y. That is incorrect. Clive, same word, jeopardy. J-E-O-P-R-E-D-Y. That is incorrect. <laughs> <laughs> All right, look. The the correct spelling for Jeopardy is J E O P A R D Y. Oh, okay. Jeopardy. Oh, man. I can't spell over the deal. I cannot spell. I'm sorry. All right, Plav, you're up. The next word is protocol. The definition for protocol a system of rules that explain the current conduct and procedures to be followed in formal situations. Protocol forbids the prince from making any public statement in his defense. Protocol. P-R-O-T-C-O-L, protocol. Say it one more time. P-R-O-T-O, oh wait. <laughs> I forgot to turn the gifts off. Hold up. I forgot to turn the gifts off. All right. Wait for the second flight. Wait for the second flight. <laughs> that should have gave you some time to spell protocol. Ready when you are. P R O T O C O L protocol. That is correct. Good job. All right, Scrap, you ready? Yeah. Chaotic. In a state of income, in a state of complete confusion and disorder. The sentence for chaotic, when you all go negative on tags, the entire app becomes chaotic. The word is chaotic. C H A. O T I C. That is correct. Good job. Oh, I was gonna spell the wrong name. <laughs> <laughs> All 
All right. The next word is bastards. <laughs> an, unpleasant, <laughs> an unpleasant or despicable person. Most of y'all are born bastard children turned adults in this live stream. Bastards. Who does that go to? You, Scrap. Oh, B A S T A R D A D S. No A, just B A S T A R D. Bastards. One more oh, time. B A S T A R D S. Correct. All right. Keeping in the lines of the same thing, Clive, your word is scoundrel, a dishonest person. The scoundrel sets a bad example for the other men. Scoundrel. Scoundrel. S-C-A-D-R-A-W-L. Scoundrel. That is incorrect. Scrappy, say word. Scoundrel. Um, can you say that word a little slower? <laughs> scoundrel. <laughs> Scoundrel. That's the word scoundrel. So scoundrel, right? All right. S C S C O U N D R U L. That is incorrect. Plob, you want to go for the same word? Uh fuck it. I'll try again. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I forgot. Um scoundrel. S C O D R A L scoundrel. That is incorrect. The correct spelling for scoundrel is C S C O U N D R E L scoundrel. I keep forgetting these ends. That's the second time. That's the second time. It's all good. I almost had it. Right, if, you just, if you just walked into my stream, my name is Soka. I'm the host of Yo, It's a Spelling Bee. We're on round one. We have Scrappy in the top right-hand corner, and we have Plob on the lower right-hand corner. We are working on the first set of words for this game. If you're in the comments, please do not spell any of the words. You will be removed from the stream. You will be removed from the stream. Shout out to BX Bomber. Anybody know where she is? Tell her to show up and show out. We're going to continue with our game. All right. Who's next? I guess it's Scrap. All right, just... Scrap. Yeah. Masquerading. Masquerading. Pretending to be someone one is not. His masquerading ended when he was arrested. Masquerading. Masquerading, right? Ma masquerading. Mm -hmm. M A S T A R A T I N G. That is incorrect. I All right, been. say word for you, Plum. Masquerading. Masquerading. I cannot spell. I really apologize for masquerading this word. <laughs> M A S C. M A S C A. I don't know. Q U A R T S K R A T I N G. I don't know. That is incorrect. That was a lot so of the re right. The the <laughs> correct spelling. <laughs> that was a lot the of extra correct, letters. Right. The correct spelling of masquerading is M A S Q U E R A D I N G. Masquerading. Okay, with a D, masquerading. Man, I thought you said masquerading. You said masquerading. I would have got That's that. What I said. She said it in the sentence and everything. Look, man, I heard an accent. Next word. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're going to let that go. 
<laughs> All right. So if you're just walking into my stream, my name is Soka. I'm the host of Yo, It's a Spelling Bee. Season one, episode 10. We have Scrappy in the top right-hand corner. We got Plow in the lower right-hand corner. We are working on round one. I need two more contestants to get ready to request the box. We need some stand-up spellers, some people with some guts to come in here and show us what you're working with. Yeah, next word. <laughs> So who's next? Is it is it you, Plav? Yes, it's me. Yeah. All right. Phishing, a type of social engineering attack, often used to steal user data, including login credentials and credit card numbers. The sentence for phishing is going to be: All major banks have fraud departments, which are engaged in a constant war against phishing. Phishing. Fishing F I S C I mean F I S C H I N G Fishing. That is incorrect. Say word, Scrappy. You said fishing, right? Yep. It's like fishing F I S H I N G. That is incorrect. I just said the definition in a right, sentence right, right, for right. fishing. Man, it's I don't know that word. Did I, do I get to try again? Yes, you can go. Come on. Is it is it F I C H I N G? That is incorrect. The correct word for fishing is P H. Oh, okay. I S H I N G. Fishing, I should have known that. It's all good. It's all good. Y'all both got it wrong. All right. Yeah. Scrap. I don't feel too bad then. <laughs> scrap, you ready? Yeah. Hineous. Hineous, a wrongful act. We watch Law and Order to solve heinous crimes. Hineous. H e n n i o u s. That is incorrect. Plot for the same word. H a n e o u s. Hineous. That is incorrect. I know you got it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot spell. You said hideous. Right, you want to try it again? Yes, I would like to try this word again. Hideous. Right. That's how I would pronounce it. So it's hideous. <laughs> hideous or hideous. I'm from New York. I'm Panamanian. Right. <laughs> yeah, motherfucking Zopa. See? I knew the fuck. I... H- if you're just walking into this live, I'm going to need you to refrain from using profanity. H E N N. I think I got it wrong already. Next word. <laughs> I don't even think it's two N's in that word. It's really not. It's actually the correct spelling for heinous crimes. Okay, is H E I N O U S heinous. Man. H-E-N. All right, we're gonna move English, on. Man. I feel it's all okay. Don't worry. We got a little plot twist when we catch that. Just hold on a second. All right. Next word is for you, Pla. Kiosk. A small freestanding physical (laughs) structure that displays information or (laughs) provides a service. Kiosk. The sentence for kiosk is. In the year 2012, the Department of Corrections introduced electronic kiosks to aid in canteen purchases. Chaos. I think it's K I A. O U S. I'm not sure. (laughs) That is incorrect. I know this word. I know you said kiosk, right? Yes. I know this word. K I O S K S. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's K. It's a K, yeah. So kiosk does not have an S on it, but because you got most of it right, I'm gonna let you. Oh, slide. you can't give it to him. Right. It wrong. <laughs> you spelled it wrong. That's wrong. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm, not, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I keep oh. wrong. All right, so we're gonna go with you, Plav, since um Scrap got it right. Millennium. 
We don't need a sentence <laughs> or a definition for the word millennium. 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 M I L L I E O. I cannot spell. Take I did your time. Not Take your time to die. M I L L I O N. O N? I don't know. O M? Millennium? I don't know. That is incorrect. Scrap the same word. M E I. I mean, whoa. M E L L I N U M. That is also incorrect. The yeah, correct. I don't like that buzzer, <laughs> <laughs> like that buzzer man. <laughs> The correct spelling for millennium is M I L L E N N I U N. Millennium. Man, that's like spelling Mississippi. Sorta. Of. Right. Okay. Okay, the next word is going to go to scrap. Yeah, you just misspelled it wrong last. Yeah, you're but right. You first. Yeah, well. That's true. So what I like to do is give the second contestant a shot, and then we'll go back to the second contestant because he didn't I'm get his. That he just got the word. He got millennium first. So and he spelled it wrong. That's why I had the second chance to get it. But now it's my turn. Okay. I mean, yeah. All right. Your word is Fahrenheit. The definition of Fahrenheit is a meaning of temperature used in the United States. The Fahrenheit is steady F- as F. A R E N H E I G H T. That is incorrect, and you cut me off. Because I thought it was a Fahrenheit. I knew I should have watched that movie. The Fahrenheit is steady at 65 degrees in November, so you have time to buy a coat. Hurry up, it's Black Friday. Plop, spell the same word. Fahrenheit. I cannot spell. This is horrible. F F. A R I E N H I <laughs> there hi I T that is incorrect. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't use two F's, I just said F twice. <laughs> Correct spelling for Fahrenheit is F A H R E N H I E T Fahrenheit. All right, we got. I feel like being blind hinders me from kind of thinking. Really? I thought it would make it easier. I mean, not really. Okay. Well, go ahead. If you just walked into my live, we're going to start round two of yours to spelling bee. So for those contestants, please request the box now so we can have you lined up um, for the second round. Thank you, Jenny. I appreciate it. All right. Next word. It's like I want to like write down so I could look at what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Like, I want to see what I'm writing. So I could, like, when you say it, I could, like, write it a couple of times. You know what I'm saying? Wait, it's cool. I ain't stressing it. Okay, so who's next now since you got all the answers? Oh, the answer, I believe it's me because he just spelled. Oh, no, it's his turn. Or he got it first and then it was my turn and I spelled it. It's his turn. Right, so it should be my turn if that's how you think it was. All right, the next word is daiquiri, a cocktail containing rum and lime juice. I like daiquiris. Spell daiquiri. That's how she used it in a sentence. <laughs> I like daiquiris. Yeah, you didn't. You didn't use it in a sentence. Did you? Oh yeah, cocktail. Uh, daiquiri. D A C A R R E. I don't know. That is incorrect, Scrappy. Same word. If I'm not mistaken, I think it's D A Q U R U I. That's also incorrect. I don't know how to spell that. All right, so the winner of round one of Yo, it's a spelling bee is Scrappy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Good job, man.
Good I job, can, good job, good job. <laughs> hey, can I take this off my head now? Yes, I yes, 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 now. yes. Tell us I a little bit about yourself, know. where we can find you before we start working on round two. Spell daiquiri. How you spell it again? I think I was actually, gonna, I was actually gonna give it to the next round of people. Okay. Hey, yeah. Poppy Versace, that joint is not funny. <laughs> <laughs> I think I still won by only spelling three words. <laughs> <laughs> I think you spelled four and I spelled three, or I spelled two and you spelled three, one or the other. I don't know, man. What's the score? Is it four? Bro, I'm or sweating. Or? Like, I'm, yo, oh, Bobby, you yo, Versace, you going next? <laughs> Let me favor you, Versace. You going next? <laughs> it was like seven words. Okay, so I'm gonna need y'all to request a box. My um, my second round of people scrap hangout while we work on. Um, Versace, <laughs> request the box so we can get started. Right, so scrap, you will be doing the final round um, of the spelling bee. The final round is going to be you and the winner of the next round, and then we'll have the winner of the whole entire game. I think you did really well. Plod, he was running. Huh? That's all today. Yeah, it's gonna be in like five minutes. It's we're only up what fifteen minutes. That's it. Oh, okay. Words are quick. I don't know how to spell that quick, so I mean we usually go pretty fast. All right. So if you just walked into the live, I'm Silka, host of Yo, it's a spelling bee. Um, every Friday here, on tagged at five o'clock. Happy Thanksgiving to everybody from yesterday. Shout out to everybody. Um, who got their top badge this week? Um, y'all go ahead and favorite top official streamer. Um, fave that page. That's Chris's page. Um, you'll be able to go to the rundown every Friday at two o'clock and get to see all the great uh, news and current events that this app has to offer. Um, shout out to everybody that's here today. Um, anybody seen BX Bomber? Make sure she's okay. Just check and make sure she's okay. I think uh, Trill came in here earlier. Shout out to her. Shout out to him. Um, we're working on round two now. Come on, Poppy. Get up in here. Request the box. Come on, Poppy. Get up in here. Request this box. Let's get the round two. Let's get this game over. Yes, I'm very serious. It's very easy. Let's go. I got easier words for you. Let's go. All right, I need two contestants for round two. Come on, City Hall. Y'all y'all know how we do. Let's get the game through. We support each other. Some of our people didn't show up. Others will. Poppy, re request the box. I know Virgo already told you what it was. Let's go. I know you're smart. I'm going to do quick, 10 quick words. It's not going to be too hard. Thank you, Jenny. Thank you, bread and butter. I oh, appreciate y'all. Thank you, Jenny. Ooh. Hi, Trini. Hello. Hello. Are, you playing, are you playing the game tonight? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Do you have a blindfold? What's this bird box spelling me? <laughs> do you have a do you have a uh do you have a blindfold for us? I'm gonna get one. Okay, I appreciate it. Okay, so we got Trini in the box while she's getting her blindfold situated. I need one more contestant to request the box so that we can be on round two of Yo, it's a spelling bee. Do not be scared. This is just a fun game. It's it's Nothing too when, when I thought I was waiting for the other person. I can't breathe. I'm claustrophobic. Uh oh. <laughs> All right, come on. Let's get the box. Okay. Who is that? Renegade. Yeah. yeah, Jenny in the back. Oh, BX Bomber, that's you. I didn't even see you. <laughs> or Hammer, so you got your words? Request the box. Let's go. We're gonna pick up where we left off. I didn't see it. Come on, baby. Request that box. Michael W. Come on, Versace, request the box. There you go. Fine ass. Poppy Versace versus Trini up in here. Poppy Versace versus Trini up in here. Yeah, bro, hold on. Let me tell you. I know I'm chocolate. All right, BX Bama, request the box so we can get started. 
If you're just walking into my stream, my name is Soka. I'm the host of Yo, It's a Spelling Bee. Yes, yes. Poppy Versace is getting his blindfold together. We got Trini up in here, okay? And we on round two. We on round two. Hi. I didn't Hi. see you. Yeah, I was late to you in the comments. You was like, oh, it's already so I was like, oh my God, I'm this late. She doesn't know me. I thought that was oh boy. That's why he say that. I was gonna say, can you tell her? I, I know, I know. You know what? I'm on war times right now. So yeah. <laughs> What's the I'm word for um yeah, you want you keep trying to take this. Tata, you still with it? us, Tata? Thank you, Michael W. All right, so if you're just walking into my stream, I'm the host of Yo, It's a Spelling Bee. We got my co-host, BX Barma, up in through here. That's the winner of the last game. That's the winner of the last game. So this is round two. Uh, we got Trini, top right-hand corner, lower left-hand corner. We got Poppy Versace. Let's get it. Let's hear your words, Barma. Please, really quick, let me just run the real quick um rules down to the contestants please allow the host and the co-host to give you a sentence and a definition before you start spelling the word anybody in the comments we do need we do not need your help do not type any answers right or wrong in the comments you will be removed by antics hawkins shout out to that let's go how many words they get um they're gonna both get um 10 apiece just because we're, we're running a little late okay. so 10 apiece all right got it Rock, yeah. paper, scissors, or? Y'all yep. ready? Y'all know how to play rock, paper, paper, scissors? Mm-hmm. Trini. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. Okay. Trini versus Poppy Versace. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Right. Rock, paper, mm -hmm. scissors, shoot. <laughs> All right, looks like Trini's Trini, right? She hits the paper. Nah, paper, paper kills rock. For real? Yeah. Shut up to that. I didn't even know that. <laughs> so <I'm> <laughs> <laughs> to me, what you mean? <laughs> hey, wait, I'm going first. Yep. No peanut butter. Mm. All right. So the first word is Dalmatian. Any of a breed of medium sized dogs having a white short haired coat with many black or brown spots. The Dalmatian barked and leaped into his owner's arms. Dalmatian. Dalmatian. Poppy's gonna spell it first. Can can everybody can y'all hear me? Yep. Dalmatian, uh, D A L M A T I O N. Dalmatian. That is incorrect. D L D A L M A T I A N. That is correct. Good job. It's the A instead of the O. Simple things. Got to win. All right, moving right along. All right. Are you ready, Trini? Yep. Mm -hmm. Definition, a sentence of a meaning of a word or a word group or a sign or symbol. Or symbol. The teacher explained the definition of the word so the students could understand. Definition. D-E-F-I-N-I-T-I-O-N. That's correct. correct. Good job, Trini. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Poppy. Next word is Colonel, a commissioned officer in the Army, Air Force, or Marine Corps, ranking above a lieutenant. The Colonel who yelled for the brigade's attention. Colonel. Go figure it out. And you, sir. Take your live phone and kick her. Yes. K-E-R-N-A-L? Yeah, I don't know. Um, this is disrespectful. C-O-U-R-N-E-L, I think. For Colonel. Go to give him the correct spelling. C-O-L. C-O-L. O-N-E-L, Colonel. Oh. <laughs> e where the L is that? Is that silent? Yeah. Yeah. It's one of the words. It's one of the words. <laughs> <laughs> Next word is magically. 
uh, produced by or as if by magic, extremely or extraordinarily pleasant, enjoyable or exciting. Lucky Charms is magically delicious. <laughs> magically. <laughs> M A G I C A L L Y. Correct. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> you ready, Bobby? Yeah. Sherbet. A cold drink of sweetened and diluted fruit juice and iced with milk and egg white or gelatin added. The sherbet shop has many flavors to choose from. Sherbet. Uh, sherbet. Damn. S H E R B E R T. That is incorrect. Close, but incorrect. <laughs> right. S E S H E R B E T. Correct. That's correct. God damn. All right. <laughs> you ready, Trini? Mm hmm. Calvary, an army component mounted on horseback. The cavalry led the way down the trail into the war. Calvary. Um, C A L V A R Y. Yeah. Okay. You wanna try? Oh, if, mm. Dang, Shirley, I was rooting for you. What you doing? Training? <laughs> oh. The British are coming. I can't stand you. Don't ask, I got to spell the same word, right? Yes. C A L A. V wait C A L A V E R Y. Incorrect. The correct spelling of that word is C A V A L R Y. Cavalry. Damn it. Poppy, ready? Yep. Yeah. Interpret to explain or tell the meaning of. Present in understandable terms. The man took his time to interpret the language into his own. Interpret. I N N T U R P T. I N T E R P R E. Wait, I N T E R T E R E T. I don't know. Shit. I don't know Why you added that extra T? Right, I'm she was extra E. Right. <laughs> Lord Jesus. Is I N T E R P R E T interpret? Ready, Trini? Yep. Relevant, having significance and demonstrable bearing on the matter at hand. The details she added were not relevant to the topic. Relevant. R E L E V A N T. Correct. Oh, that's correct. Good job. You ready, Poppy? <laughs> no, but let's do this. Jaded. <laughs> made dull, apathetic, or cynical by experience or by having or seeing too much of something. In 2022, the men are jaded. Jaded. Before I spell this, I just want to say that no. if I get this wrong, it's Drake's fault. J-A-D-E-D. No. <laughs> jaded. Correct. Let's go, Jason. <laughs> Let's Good go. God, Poppy. Go. Oh, put me on the map. Put my, my boy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. It's always, the kids is always around, y'all. Sorry. Yeah. Projection: the act of throwing or thrusting forward. P R O J E C T. You said shun or ing. Projection. I O N. Right. I was gonna give you a sentence, but you you jumped in there, so I just let you go. On. Oh damn, my bad. <laughs> I get that point, right? I automatically get that point. Ain't that how that works? I heard that in the rules earlier. I thought. <laughs> <laughs> All right. 
um is that the tenth word right there no actually that's the eighth word okay mm -hmm. right because they had to do some of the same mm -hmm. selection a natural or artificial process that results or tends to result in the survival and propagation of some individuals or organisms but not of others with the result that the interpreted traits of the survivors are perpetuated <laughs> I chose my baby father because he was a better selection <laughs> than the other men. Selection. <laughs> Thank you, Maja. F E C C E L E T I O N. That's incorrect. S E L E. C T I O N. Correct. Oh, I, actually, I added the extra E in it. Um, okay, I see what happened. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, uh. We got more? Yep. You ready? Mm -hmm. Accordion. A portable keyboard wind instrument in which the wind is forced past free reeds by means of a hand operated bellows. Mm. The Irish band. Played several accordions that hurt my eardrums. Accordion. <laughs> um, I don't even know. I ain't gonna hold you. Is it O C or D? C O C C O R D I A N. Mm. <laughs> I got this. So back in the day, I used to drive a Honda Accord. So I was a <laughs> so A C C O R D. Accord D D. If I had to say D's nuts, I would say okay. Accord A C C O R D E I E N E I E I I. Yes. Okay. That, was wrong. <laughs> that was wrong, but you was close. Using the Honda Accord as the beginning was really, you know, that was clutch right there. You know what I'm saying? All right. right. <laughs> so it's A C C O R D I O N accordion. Mm, okay. Okay. I missed that. <laughs> okay. So I wanted I wanted to add a plot twist to the game, um, okay. but this week. I don't know if we're going to have time. What time is it? Okay, 5, 5.52. I don't think we're going to have time because we have to do uh, one more round and one more round. We're going to do five words. But I will give a little bit of um, a little piece of it out there. So for the ones who don't win the round, I wanted to give them an option of staying in the game by either them choosing to do a math problem or for them choosing to pick five words from a thesaurus that would um, be a similar word to one word that I chose. So we're gonna just give an example today. Plot twist. So it looks like Trini will win the round. Poppy Versace, tell me, would you like to choose something from the mathematics textbook or thesaurus textbook? Give me the math. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, this is the plot twist of y'all with the spelling bee. We're going to add a little razzle dazzle to this game. Are you ready for your math word? I was born ready. All right, Tobias is scared that the banks will close on him. And he's afraid that a fire will come and burn everything he has. So he keeps his cash savings frozen in a big piece of ice in the freezer he has forty three hundred dollars in a freezer in cash his brother jude keeps his cash stack inside his teddy bear jude has half the amount that tobias has how much does jude have stuffed in his teddy bear Uh, damn, that was, all right, uh, $2,150. All right. Stop. 
Give me my money. Yo, Poppy Versace, you smart. You smart. You smart. You smart. You smart. You All right, so look. <laughs> All right, listen. Man, you know them numbers. You want to go with Dragon right there, y'all. I thought I almost got to go with Dragon right there. <laughs> so listen. Poppy, I really appreciate you playing the game. Yeah. That's for your math problem. Okay? Regardless of what, that's for your math problem. Shout out to Poppy Versace, but we're going to move on. Trini versus Scrappy for this final Ooh. round of y'all with the spelling bee. Scrappy, request the box. Thank you for Poppy, thank you for playing. Let us know when you stream. I don't know if y'all can hear me, bro, but hey, Silk, I appreciate you. This shit was dope as hell. I'm sorry if this feature, this stuff was dope as hell. You know what I'm I appreciate everybody. I do stream 6 30 p.m. Eastern times. I want y'all to come check out my business, sir. I think you know what it's man. Come check that out. And I got a new show coming out December 4th. I got a new show coming out December 4th. It's called Skip the Good. Come check that out, man. 9 p.m. Eastern times on Sunday. Y'all come check that out. Thank you, Poppy, for playing. Already. All right. So shout out to Poppy Versace. So pretty and scrappy. What's up, Bama? What's up, BX? What's up, Bama? Miss Thang, you kind of late. We got to, you know, we, we down at our final round, but I would love for you to be here next Friday at 5 Eastern Standard. Bronx, New York time. You heard Bronx, New York time. All right. So we're going to move right along. BX, we're going to let you take over for the rest of the game. We're going to do five words apiece. Go ahead and knock it out. The winner of Yo, It's a Spelling Bee will be one of you, the two, Trini or Scrap. Let's get it. Uh, they doing rock, paper, scissors, or? Yes, do rock, paper, scissors, y'all. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock beats the scissors. All right, so Scrap goes first. Let's get it. I'm ready when it'll be ready. Oh, all right. Mm -hmm. First word is vamoose to depart quickly. With the sheriff and his posse hot on their trails, the bank robbers knew they better vamoose. 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 V A M O S. V A M O S. V A M O S. And. <laughs> Come on, Vamanos. Isn't it V A M O O S? That's incorrect. Vamoose is spelled V A M O O S E. Moose, literally. Uh, <laughs> I don't feel bad then. <laughs> All right, next word. You ready, Trini? Mm hmm. Saponify. Hmm. Saponify means to convert into soap specifically, to hydrolyze a fat with alkali to form a soap and glycerol. You can use baking fat to saponify and make soap products. Saponify. Um, S E R A. And I have why I don't know. Scrappy. <laughs> Scrappy. Saponified. S O P O N A F I D E. That is unfortunately incorrect. The correct spelling is S A P O N I F Y. Saponify. Oh. Okay. Scrap, you ready? Yeah. Asshole. A stupid, annoying, or detestable person. Usually vulgar. The least attractive or desirable part or area. 
This, these days, this the real assholes. Word? What? That's the real word, asshole. <laughs> yes, yeah. Let me let her finish the sentence. Thank you. <laughs> these. <laughs> Uh, go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> DJ was an asshole at the party, but later on, I told him about himself. Asshole. A S A S S H O L E. Correct. That's correct. <laughs> <laughs> I, just had to make sure I was. I had to make sure I was hearing correct. Like that's really the word. <laughs> <Literally. All right. laughs> Are you ready, Trini? Mm-hmm. Swizzle to drink, especially to excess. Many tiki drinks cause me to drink swizzles of it. Swizzle. S W I Z Z L E. Correct. Swizzle. Correct. Good job. Swizzle. Okay, here we go. You ready, Scrappy? Yeah. Bamboozle to confuse, frustrate, or throw off thoroughly or completely. Being only three months on this app, people try to bamboozle me together. Bamboozle. B A M B O Z O O L. Incorrect. Say No, incorrect. The true spelling of bamboozle is B A M B O O Z L E. Bamboozle. Yes, now you can take it. In. You can take it and go do it yourself. <laughs> Till I finish my game, because I know y'all see me on the phone, but y'all want to be all up in my space while I'm doing this. Gosh, <laughs> they're trying to be me into being mommy right now. When I said I'm going to break, right? <laughs> 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 all okay, right. Hmm, take it, enjoy. It. All right, ready for the next word? Exquisite. Marked by flawless craftsmanship or by beautiful indigenous delicate or elaborate execution. He chose his words with exquisite care. Exquisite. Who's it on? I think me. Oh, okay. E-X-Q-U-I-S-I-T-E. Correct. Yep, good job. Thank you. All right. Scrap. Hello. Ingredients Angry. as in components. Ingredients as in components, one of the parts that make up a whole. I write down all the ingredients for my recipes before I begin cooking. Ingredients. I N G R E I D E N T S. Three. What is it? I N G R E D I E N T S. Correct. Thank you, Big Little. Okay, we're going to do the final word for tonight's show. And we're going to give it to Scrap to start. You ready? Hooligan, are you in here, Hooligan? That's the word. Wait, wait, no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm looking for somebody. Hooligan, are you in here? Before we finish the game, if you just walked in here, my name is Soka. I'm the host of Yo, It's a Spelling Weed. This is episode 10 right here. Episode 10, season one. We got BX Bomber as our co-host. We, we on our final round. We got Trini, top right-hand corner, scrap low right-hand corner. Um, And this is the final word of the entire game. Panamami, I see you. Let's get it. Kakamami. Absurd and outlandish. Sometimes 
while going through lives, I see lots of cockamamie things going on. <laughs> cockamamie. What's the word? <laughs> cockamamie. Cockamamie? I ain't even never heard of that Cock word. Me cockamamie. All right. C O. I don't even remember the word. Next. All right, go ahead. I'm <laughs> Cockamani. Go ahead. You done, Scrap? Yeah, it's on Trini. I don't know. C O C C K O. A M E M E. I don't know. Very close, but unfortunately, that is incorrect. The appropriate spelling of cockamamie is C O C A M A M I E. Cockamamie. And that word, it is exactly, it sounds just like its definition, right? Absurd and outlandish. <laughs> yeah, I never even heard of that word. It looks like. It looks like uh, Trini is the winner of Yo, It's a Spelling Bee. Woo! Congratulations. Take your blindfold off. Reveal yourselves. Reveal Let's yourselves. See again. Woo. <laughs> oh, man. Thank you I so much for having me. Damn, my way. Sorry, you didn't, sorry, the name change didn't make you see me, but I'm Thanks. glad I stayed. <laughs> I appreciate y'all. Um, Trini, thank you for being a contestant. Um, I appreciate that. I like that game. Shout out to BX Bomber. Please hit up with the fave. Scrappy! Thank you, Scrappy! Thank you for playing, Scrap! You're welcome. I wasn't prepared for this. This was the last moment. This was the last minute thing. But. I know. I know. And, and if you don't mind coming back, as you know, part of win is great. You know, we appreciate that. A lot of people came here to see you. We we like you here. <laughs> yeah. I will be back. Thank you. Y'all hit Trini with the favorite. Um, tonight's winner is Trini. Uh, yo, it's a spelling bee. Anything you want to say, Trini, before you before you leave us? Oh, your show is really dope. You know, get y'all using the brain and everything versus just the phones with right. auto spell everything. <laughs> <laughs> I learned some new words. I ain't know no cockamamie. I'm I'm gonna start using that. You are very cockamamie right now, and I'm not feeling it. So. <laughs> So when do you stream? Show. When do you stream so we can? I don't really stream. I'm new to this. Jenny be trying to get me on, but I just be watching her for real. Shout out to Jenny City Hall. You what? Right? <laughs> Thank you, Trini. Thank you. Bye, y'all. Bye. So Trini is the winner of Yo, it's a spelling bee. Thank y'all for pulling up, supporting this game. This is our tenth game. Jenny. Appreciate that. Um, BX Bomber, y'all hit up with the favorite. Um, shout out to everybody who just got here, who likes the game. Um, every Friday at 5, this game will be um, going down. So please, inbox me if you're interested in being a contestant. All that good, 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 good. Um, Antics, you still around for your final thought? Or are uh, you packing us up, then, uh, buddy? Are we ending it without you tonight? You were late! You were late again! You were late. Oh man, here we go, here we go. <laughs> Yo, shout out to Trini. Shout out to City Hall for coming through today, man. Jenny, you feel me? On the uh, little assist right there, we needed that. Shout out to Scrappy coming back. I ain't seen Scrappy in so long. Like, that's crazy. I ain't seen this man in months. So, I was surprised to see you in the box. I was late. Stop telling my business. Because look, I was looking for <laughs> All day, like it's crazy. I know. Shout out to the city of Hodo, for real. Shout out to um our theme song though. You know? Right. Big city on that. Hopefully, little. 
Shout out to the trolls getting in a box. I ain't never thought I would see Plot in the box. I ain't never think I would see right. in the box. Though. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. Like, Versace is funny. Yep. He don't know how to spell, but he know numbers. Stop yes. playing with that man. Yo, it's Big City Hall. Y'all appreciate y'all pulling up. Y'all ready to go. Yeah. 